Hello everyone, thank you for joining me. So today we're gonna work on Anna Griffin, the big box, Christmas box, 2020 edition, where you can make 48 plus cards. So let's open this box up and make some beautiful festive cards for Christmas. So here is our inspiration sheet where you're gonna get a full four pages of card inspiration. Super, super helpful for those of us that are new crafters or for those of us that just think the box has way too much and we don't know where to start. So you're gonna get 48 cards. You have greens, you have ivory, you have uh, gray, which is like your silver, you have red, then you have your whites, you have um, foil on most of them. Some of them don't have foil such as this one and that's if you wanna tone it down a little. So beautiful, beautiful colors. You're then gonna get layers. So we have layers if you wanna, this is optional. So you get layers. You're gonna get gold matte foil for embossing and die cutting. Love that. And that is five by seven. You're also gonna get embellishments. So, just to take out a few, we have trees, we have baubles, we have presents, we have wreaths. There's deer in there, there's uh, uh, trumpets, or not trumpets, uh, horns. Christmas tree is in there. So some of the embellishments, and that's not all the embellishments you get. The next set of embellishments I'm gonna show you is gonna be the botanicals. So you get a lot of holiday greenery here. So there's holly, of course, there's berries, there's uh, white and looks like burgundy points or red poinsettias. And then there's bayberries, there's roses, there's a Christmas rose. So lots of nice greenery. And your holly has gold foil on it. So that's nice, but that's not it. We're gonna keep going, I promise you. We'll get to the card making. We also have, of course you get your envelopes. You get foam adhesive. So you don't need anything unless you wanna use the matte foil. So in this one, you're getting a, a lots of gold foil flourish. You're getting like snowflakes, there's like holly in here, botanicals, and you're gonna get like some other layers as well, such as this, this, and then there's a color one in here. Okay, we're not done, we're not done. This is the big box. And this is gonna be her big release for Christmas this year. There will be lots more things to be excited about, but this is like the, this is like the big deal. So then we have card toppers. So what that is, is your one and done. So plenty of card toppers here. Very beautiful. And then we also have, we're still going. It's not called big box. We have loads of sentiments. All kinds, greens, reds, gold, whites, gray for your silver. And we also, to top it off, we have ribbons. And these are the perfect size ribbons, beautiful ribbons, gold and red, to accent each and every card. So let's get started and make some beautiful cards. So now we're actually gonna go ahead and work on a card. So I've paused the video to kind of gather some of the items. So for the first card, what we're gonna do, I've chosen this beautiful green card, like a beautiful evergreen. And I chose to go ahead and die cut and emboss some of the matte uh, gold cardstock and it embosses beautifully. Can you see that? 
how beautiful is that snowflakes and then i also want to share with you this one that i did as well i love it look at that just perfect i know the light for the camera is sorry about that but look at the embossing that paper is everything so we just need some adhesive which she provided i believe it's 500 pieces and we can just go ahead and go to work unless you would like to use glue um, if you want to use liquid glue or your tape runners so it's super easy other than using the card stock to die cut and emboss you don't need anything else no scissors you even have your envelope oh one thing to mention this kit does not come with card inserts so for your sentiments for the inside of your card those are sewed separately okay so i've chosen this beautiful deer i love this deer you're getting two deers in this pack so these are most of these in here are stickers so you're going to just peel the back of it and it's super pretty easy i have on you know my nails but i still was able to do that and you just peel them off if you don't want to use that then you just use your foam adhesive so lay my deer there then i took out some holly i'm gonna put here and these are stickers as well so the same thing you're just peeling off the back and i'm just gonna lay my holly and then i have this that says happy christmas and i believe this is a sticker as well so i'm gonna kind of move my deer over just a little here so that i can put this on okay that works and i believe this is a sticker yes it is so yeah uh, like i say you don't need anything really i'm just gonna go ahead and slide that on and then let me take this one off here and then look at that how quick was this card not even three minutes not even three minutes how pretty is that now we're gonna go ahead and make another one since that one was super quick i want to show you how to use the card toppers so i've chosen another card and the card topper basically what it is is a one and done so what you would do is take your card if you want to take one of the um, layers you can or you could just put some adhesive on it put it on just like that there you go a beautiful card beautiful okay so i'm gonna go ahead and put that on but i'm gonna add some of the botanicals to this and i'm going to show you how we can go ahead and start layering layering it up and she did provide she did provide um embellishments to match all of this so i'm going to show you that as soon as we get this on oops make sure you got it right so you just here and you just line it up and you just lay it there and your card would be done a one and done but i'm going to go ahead and add some botanicals to it so you see this here how it matches this so i'm just going to go ahead and peel this sticker off on the back and then what i would do is just kind of line it up a little bit and just overlay it so this is just to give some dimension to the card and i'm just going to take another one and put that one on the bottom i love my tweezers i don't know if you guys notice but i'm always using my tweezers they save me i like for my nails to look nice but sometimes it's difficult Okay, so then I'll just line this up here like that. And that's it. 
and there we go we did a one and done and we just added some embellishments to give it some dimension another beautiful quick two to three minute card now for this one I'm going to show you this one I took another card and I'm going to use the layer this time so for the layer same thing you just pick whatever layer you want and I'm just going to put some foam adhesive on that and I love that she provides the foam adhesive so like I say you could just go over your friend's house or your sister or your your boyfriend I don't know whoever you craft 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 excuse me with and just scatter this over the table and yeah you got 48 cards that's a lot that's a lot of cards it's a, it's a really good value I think it was very generous for the price too okay so line that up in the middle sometimes it's hard for me to see okay okay that's good enough so now I'm going to go ahead and use some florals that were provided some Christmas florals so these are stickers so I'm just gonna go ahead and peel these off I promise you it's easy it really is you saw I was doing some of them earlier so I'm just gonna how do I want this I'm just trying to create a little bouquet so I'm gonna lay this one down first so this is going to be like a, a a Christmas bouquet and who is ready for the holidays I am with everything going on in the world Christmas is my most favorite time of the year and I am just ready for some good news I'm ready for a change I'm just gonna lay that here and then this one I'll put there okay no I think I wanna I don't know put that there and this here a struggle huh I'm gonna overlay it okay that works right there so see that and then now we're gonna use one of these beautiful bows so for the bowls you can use the foam adhesive I'm actually going to use some 3D glue gel to do that. Okay. So sometimes I, when I use the foam for the bows, for some reason it comes off. I don't know why. Okay. So there is that one. So look at that. How quick and easy were these three cards? love this if you don't have this you can purchase this at her website oh, stow away okay so look at this so before I got back on camera with you after I opened the box I did go ahead because I couldn't help myself and I made some cards so these are the ones that I made with you right here quick very very quick and then these are the ones that I made um, before I got back on camera okay so just different ways here's another one this one's super basic all I did was take a card take a layer and I took one embellishment just one and I just put it on the top and then you can put your sentiment and then I made this one and I used the topper on this one a layer and I just laid some embellishments on that one and then finally I did this one and then this one I took the car took a layer picked three of the embellishments and a bow and there it is so I made those how many was that one two three four cars probably in less than like 25 minutes so super quick super easy 
a very, very beautiful, beautiful, generous box. And it is still available on HSN. And um, I'm not sure if she's going to bring it to her website. So I will grab it if I were you. It's a beautiful box. And yeah, enjoy making your Christmas cards. And thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.